When I was growing up, uh, music has been in my blood. So since I've been born, I've been naturally drawn to music. My parents always listened to a lot of jazz and uh, actually just a, a pretty wide variety of stuff. Uh, so since I've been, since I can even remember having a thought, I've been listening to music and I've always loved it. I decided to actually start playing an instrument when I was about 12 or 13 and uh, that was the guitar which uh, led to me playing other instruments and then later on I got into uh, recording and stuff so um, well like I said my parents were very into jazz so I listened to people such as uh, Rochelle Farrell um, Weather Report, Mahavishnu Orchestra, with like John McLaughlin stuff, and uh, that kind of got later on when I got into high school and went through the whole rebellious stage, I guess. <laughs> I uh, got into some metal and listened to a lot of Periphery and uh, things like Born of Osiris and things that are on Sumerian Records, basically, all those bands. And uh, later on, I got out of that because I found it to be kind of shallow music, so... I started getting into more like songwriting and uh, kind of got went back to my roots and got into bluegrass, which is what my grandpa used to play a long time ago. So uh, I listened to the Punch Brothers, whatever Chris Thiele makes, I pretty much listened to any of that. And uh, I've been looking to get into more Punch Brothers and other bluegrass related stuff. David Greer, lots of guitar stuff actually. So I decided to start studying jazz a little bit more. Uh, while I started doing the production stuff because people would come in and I'd write on their things and whenever I would write on their stuff it would help to have like sheet music to write it out on or be able to transcribe it so that it's something organized so I'm looking to get into engineering and producing very much so